Prime Minister Dr. Terence Drew described the so-called peace program set up under the former Team Unity government as a corrupt program, although the initial intentions were good. Speaking in the National Assembly sitting of 19 December 2023, Dr. Drew spoke of an itemized category called on-track cash wages of the program. According to Prime Minister Drew, who is also the Minister of National Security, the peace program has been corruptly misused. Let me pull our country's attention and this honourable house's attention to use of funds, a part here called untracked cash wages. Untracked. Nobody knows where this money has gone. Untracked. Cannot be traced, Madam Speaker. Don't a dark hole. Disappear. Poof. He gone. That amount, Madam Speaker, 22 million, 244,810 dollars. Does the member from number five know about this money? He said he knows about the program. Does he know about the 22 million, 244,810 dollars? Gone down a dark hole. Poof, he gone. Let me say it in fancy terms, Madam Speaker. On track cash wages. Madam Speaker, this is the program that he's talking about, that he knows everything about. He himself has said it. The member from number seven has also said it. This is what is happening. This was used to embezzle money, hide money, fill the pockets of politicians and their cronies, Madam Speaker. This objective wasn't to bring a long-lasting peace and to rehabilitate anybody. Had persons been rehabilitated, you think the condition could have researched? Never. That is what the program was used for, and that is why we are saying the government has to get back its $22 million plus, and we know more is missing, Madam Speaker. And then coming to tell the country about this program. This program was setting us up to destroy the fabric of our society. I remember talking to the Prime Minister um, of Jamaica, and he said to me, PM, don't go down that road. He said, do not go down that road. Don't do it. I'm speaking from Jamaica's experience. Warn me. And that is why, Madam Speaker, we are saying that this is not the answer. This has been a corrupted system that embezzled money, robbed the country of tens of millions of dollars. And had the money been really spent in a legitimate program to rehabilitate people, people would have been rehabilitated. Prime Minister expressed the view that the program would have been detrimental to the country if continued. He announced in Parliament that the program's replacement, Elevate, will be launched on Thursday, 21st December 2023. Glenn Bart reporting for SKN Newsline.